he is. Steve and the boys. And of course, the man we came to see. Excuse me, are you Warren? Help you boys get loaded. <laughs> You're the guy who buys booze for kids? Sure, it's a great way to make money. That's how I bought my boom box, that's how I bought my dog Pepper, and that's how I bought this folding chair that turns into a backpack. I put it on and I'm completely mobile. Fire! Great. We'd like liquor, please. All right, be right back. If some little girl with a bruise on her cheek comes by and says this is her dog, it is. Pepper is stolen. <laughs> oh! The shout out to Addicted to American Dad. Great channel. I'm part of a workplace ensemble. I bet he's the sarcastic guy, and he's the dumb guy. Oh my god, he must be the black guy who doesn't talk. Hello? Yes. These are mean streets we live on, streets soaked with blood. I just fished a <laughs> dead hooker out of the canal. Roger, what are you talking about? Oh, it's my new hard-boiled P.I. character. I find role-playing helps me cope with the soul-crushing boredom around this place. May I proceed? Uh, okay. Yeah, Shut your hole, crazy broad. <laughs> I had to call that poor dead girl's parents. Do you have any idea what that's like? Do you? Damn this city! And scene. That was such a spot-on impression, and that's the thing with Roger's persona. He actually does a great job with every single one. And that's why we're about to take a look at every Roger male persona that there is so far. If you have any American Dad reaction requests, go ahead and drop those down in the comments. But if you have something that you want me to see specifically, go ahead and drop that as well. Thanks for letting me interview you for the Anne Rice Fan Club newsletter. Oh, no problem. How did you get my number again? Huh? Oh, from your high school principal. Uh. Yeah, huge Anne Rice <laughs> fan. Total mo. Hi, uh, reservations for two under Roger. Who's Don't Anne Rice? Excellent. Hold up, hold up, yo. I heard there's a new <laughs> badass driver in this mug. What's they up, call him cuss? the suit. I'll tell you something right now. He crazy. Yo, yo, suit's in the house. Oh, hey, girl. Holla at you, boy. I can't wait to enroll here. People are finally going to take me seriously. Don't they have college on your planet? Yeah, but if you're not Asian, it's impossible to get in. Hey, Ethan. <laughs> God, uh... Ethan's so hot. And he completely ignores me. It makes him so much hotter. What are you talking about? He totally ignored me, and I don't think he's hot at all. Ah, now I see it. Now I'm seeing it. There's Roger. I'm Professor Guggenheim. Guggenheim? Wait, is there another G? Or is it... I'm Professor Baxter, <laughs> and you'll be respecting me this semester. <laughs> what are you doing? I went to talk to the dean, one lie led to another, and he asked me to teach this class. You can't teach. Quiet, please. <laughs> you may have thought this class was about literature. You were wrong. This class is about life. Okay. Electric word, life. It means forever, and that's a mighty long time. But I'm here to tell you, there's something else. My office hours, they're Tuesday from 1 to 3. Mm. So, did you get that part on Ryan's Hope? No, they really like me, but they're going with someone a little more flesh-colored with a nose. Give it up, loser. I'm not a loser! <sighs> Disco's greatest hits, best songs from 1974 to 1980. This tape is from the future, but that's impossible. What? On the other hand, I'm a spaceman working <laughs> in a lane, so maybe I should open my mind a bit. Congratulations, you just made your first million. Go. I'm a winner, Ma! Look at me now! <laughs> now don't look for a second. There you go. Woo! You yeah. can look again, Ma! <laughs> Alright, quick question. You get a million dollars, what's the first thing you're doing? I mean, the first thing you're doing with it, drop that down in the comments. Steve said you were here. Mr. President, I have something important to show you. I hope you brought your checkbook. <laughs> Uh, that's our maid. <laughs> oh, fun. I love Mexicans. W. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that rocked. Who are you? I'm Krispy Kreme McDonald's. My Krispy Kreme <laughs> mama got <laughs> raped by my McDonald's daddy. <gasps> Whoa. Get out. Get out of my bedroom. <laughs> That's crazy. Yo, out of it. Out of there. Roger, thank God. Where were you? You didn't come home last night. Oh, I was well looked after, Stephen. 
I found a new boy. A boy who won me something worth 750 tickets at the arcade. That's more than you make in a year. Boy, Impressive. I have never told a guy about my nose job on the first date before. It's a good first date. What do you think about maybe doing it again? Jerry, will you marry me? It's Shari, and yes! Oh, Jacob, you have made me so happy. Ma, you won't believe it. He asked me to marry him. Yes, the orthodontist, Brandeis. Reformed, Ashkenazi. Haven't seen the car. I know, is it great? We did it, Ma! Jesus. We finally did it! <laughs> Over here. <laughs> Ugh, what is that? A Manhattan. I feel great! Timmy, it's not nice to point. But he doesn't have a nose. Mm. He can't help it if he's deformed. Deformed? I'm just as God made me, madam. <laughs> Bacon. Scurabeco! Tremors won three Saturn Awards! What's a Saturn Award? You're missing the point! You're right, oh, he's got sorry. A nose. That's Kevin Bacon! They think you're Kevin Bacon. What? Yes, Haley, I understand things that happen around me. Okay, but why does that actually kind of look like Kevin Bacon? I can never unsee this. This is what my mind is going to go to when I hear Kevin Bacon now. Did someone order a sickly? I understand things that happen around me. Did someone order a sexy Persian wingman? Let's go. I gotta keep moving or these pants will cut off my circulation and my legs will die. I I'm just gonna go. Ah, oh, thank God, that guy sucked so much. I only invited him because our folks had to escape Tehran together. We left everything behind, our house, our cars, my little brother. Oh my God, this is my song! I totally asked him to play this! What? what? What's going on? I'm Steve's cousin. I tripped on your walkway and I need compensation. I'll take a check. And I'll need two forms of ID. Passport's okay or a utility bill with your current... You know what? You're boring me. Make it a thousand cash. You get paid to look honest. He's actually a big scammer. Cup of your hottest coffee, please. Remember, you're the face, I'm the brain. Here it is. Oh, this <laughs> cup is irresponsibly hot. Oh, my face! Oh! Damn! <laughs> For real? Exactly. God, baby, your back is so toned. Oh, my lats. Yeah, the electric can opener broke. I've been opening them manually. With these <laughs> big, strong hands, oh, they make me feel so safe. Thanks. Cans again. I'll tell you the cans I like. Oh, sassy hands. Don't just get one cheek, girl. Other side. <laughs> you poached my bear! Yeah! <laughs> Dog. What the hell are you doing? I'm taking my bounty back. Ah, what's your problem? <laughs> oh, you mean besides being shot at by a bottom-heavy freak? Dick. You know it's awkward when I try to jog. Recent rumblings dick. from the art world suggest the market should decide this one. I'll be holding the auction this Saturday. Bailey! <gasps> I feel weird looking at that. Whoever heard of a sad clown? Will you tell my fortune? Steve, before she tells you your future, let me tell you her past. 40 years of alcoholism and three doctorless abortions. Mm. You are a Roger. sad, angry little person. Hello, Shabber <laughs> Image. Yeah, give me three Sopranos pinball machines, Tony. the radio golf ball, a floating ant farm, a flashlight hammer to smash the ants with if they piss me off. I'm, uh, <laughs> gonna call right back. What the hell is that? Now, while I hacked the database, you created a version. A diversion? Oh, this is a caper, like in the movies. Speaking of movies, you ever seen Man on Fire? Is that the one with that? Ah! Oh, oh I suppose you have a better backstory. My name is Braff Zecklin. I was an international race car driver. One day, a baby carriage rolled out onto the track, so I swerved into the retaining wall to avoid it. The car burst into flames, but the baby miraculously survived. I was that baby. That doesn't make any sense. I'm Braff Zacklin! All right, so not only are the impressions spot on and perfect, but the backstories that he comes up with for these characters are absolutely absurd. Like, for real, I feel like there could be a whole entire other series just about his personas. You know what I'm saying? I'm playing poker tonight with a couple of guys from work. We need a fourth, so Chili's coming along. Chili? You heard right, baby. What's they call up, Chili? me Chili because I got ice in my veins. <laughs> What's with these cards, Bad Larry? You're screwing me with these cards! Did, did I clean my toilet with a washcloth and then jam it into your mother's mouth? What? Because that's Ugh. what you're doing to me! <laughs> Hello to a well-behaved fellow who's very sorry. I'm very sorry. 
I know I've been a real pain, but He's I'm gonna not. be super nice from now on. I trust you'll enjoy my spa, Mr. Stan Smith of the CIA. In fact, you'll like it so much, you'll never leave. <laughs> oh my god, you smell that? I had a pickle an hour ago. Came with my Reuben. I'm so fat. Now, who does Betty know me as? Cousin Phil, number 302. He's got him ready to go. That's crazy. 302 personas. God, that woman's manipulative. She uses her personal drama as an excuse to come here, take over Stan's life, and elbow me out. Threatened by the visiting mother-in-law. Cliché. Oh. <laughs> Tacos! Oh. Who's crying? Merry Christmas. I'll have you know I studied at the feet of the master, Dr. Phil. It's Oprah approved. Oprah, 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 Oprah! My card. <laughs> the only currency I accept is the joy I get from helping my patients. This Deal. is a seven of diamonds. Yeah, you're gonna have to write my fake phone number <laughs> down on that. Klondike 52487. I'm a ninja, everybody! I'm doing ninja stuff now! What's up, ninja? D-Day, 1944. <laughs> you think about the bravery, the heroism that happened here. It's just... Humbling. Mm -hmm. Men younger than us. Boys, really. Just boys. Trying to fight off an American invasion. I, I was talking about the Americans. <laughs> uh, the Germans were brave, Crazy. too. Crazy! I forgot. Brave, maybe. I forgot. You'll be answering to Peters now. Give him anything he needs. Guess I'm the boss of you. What's your name? Stan. Hmm. I already know a Stan. I'm gonna call you Mortimer. Now run and fix Mortimer? me a coffee. Mortimer? Today, Mortimer James. <laughs> what kind of name is man. that? I'm disappointed in him. Name's Luke Fondelberg. Just started today. Any hot pieces of tail around this office that like a good groping? You're fired. You see that episode of Seinfeld Thursday night ten years ago? <laughs> uh, Want to me? Fondelberg. Did you sexually harass Miss Vanderboobin? You bet your ass I did. I harassed the crap out of her. <laughs> Damn it. I only have to pay her a settlement. <laughs> You're fired. Uh, Both of those things work for me. See you in hell. Vanderboobin. He's king. He's king. That spring break sucks. I could throw a better spring break than that loser. I'm Scotch Bingington, the true king of spring break. My scepter <laughs> shoots shivers. And this end dispenses Luden's cough drops. I'm fighting something. <laughs> what, what, what's, what's going on? My tequila! Sit down, amigo. That worm had a name! Now, if you will excuse me, I am late for my daughter's arranged wedding. That was wedding. so fast! You will learn to love him. <laughs> May I help you? Yes, I'm looking for a Judy Panowitz. What a coincidence! Oh, oh now Judy he's Panowitz. the Fonz! Hey. Love. Why can I never find your mate? Did I donate it to that soldier I read about who lost his arm in Iraq? No, I would have remembered getting a sloppily written thank you note. I can't find my dinosaur stickers. Well, you'll have to look for them yourself. AJ has a boo-boo. Where'd the baby come from? I have a boo-boo, too. <laughs> wow. You did that on purpose. Roger, what the hell? <laughs> I would have never come down here if you hadn't declared this the summer of exotic adventure. Ah, Chinatown. Where you could tell me it was Japantown or Koreatown, and I'd nod and smile. Delivery for the Phantom wow. of Telethon. Oh, my God, my pipe organ, yay! This da -da -da. is what I'm supposed to play maniacally down da -da -da. in the catacombs? Oh, what'd you think you were getting for thirty nine ninety five? No, no, this is totally unacceptable. <laughs> it's fire. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I can work with this. How often does Roger win free passes to a first-class spa? Oh, once isn't enough? No, Roger, I meant it as a good thing. Well, that's not how it sounded. Y you have a way about you, Haley, that just... Ugh, turns me off. Ow! She bit me! What? <gasps> you were gonna let me die for $1,800? No. Yes. No. <laughs> not now, Stephen. I have a meeting in, like, one minute. Pretend to be my assistant. And if this guy asks, my name is Freddie Underwood. Porn screenwriter extraordinaire. 
Helicopter Perry, the sleaziest porn producer east of Van Nuys. Come here, you son of a bitch bastard. So, how's the smut business, HP? The internet's killing me, Freddy. Every frat boy with a digital <laughs> camera thinks he's a filmmaker now. Facts. I've seen what you speak of. Dumpster sluts and the like. There's no Old art video in it heaven. When can we see it? Oh, no, no, you will not be attending this abortion. Ugh, the director's an idiot, the lead can barely speak English, and the second lead is 30 pounds overweight. P.S., I'm the second lead, and I'm starving. Okay, first of all, I don't believe in any of this therapy nonsense. <gasps> the Logans! Oh, my God, the Logans! They were the first family I ever lived with, and then they abandoned me years ago, and I haven't been able to trust anybody ever since! Thank you, Doctor, you are a miracle worker! You see that, people? That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. You make me sick. I need to know. <laughs> Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter. We were afraid of you. Jenny, you better shut up right now or I will cut your face. If it's the same <laughs> Roger who takes his pints down at the cat in the fiddle, he is prone to disguises. I also hear he's wanted in a string of prostitute murders he is. Hon. Okay. We'll get there eventually. The foot. I have everything down. Oh, do you? Indeed. What's my favorite breakfast sausage? Vice first. With? Sauerkraut. Also with? Hefeweizen. Baseball player? Show and vice. Tennis racket? Schlesinger. Made up word. Shagelbarben. I have nothing left to teach you. You're ready for the inheritance, lawyers. Oh, wait, there is something else you should know. I bedazzled my genitalia. Ah, oh, then we have a happy coincidence going on here. <laughs> Roy Rogers McFreely is the name, chairing the Homeowners Association's My Game. Yes, I know what you're thinking, but the jacket is vintage. You won't be able to find one anywhere. I need to have this form signed by the owner of a real business. This is a real business. To wit. Rogers Place. Ew, it's filled with fingernail clippings. I mix them in with the wasabi peas. No one notices. I also have a business license. Probably should have started with that. Fine, Mr. Calhoun. I'll get right on it. Great. And after that, you can clean my pants up, because I just missed a Belvedere myself. Google it. You know, one thing I never understood with TV shows and movies and, like, these fictional brands and things that they come up with, they never adapt them into real life. And if they do, it's always trash. Like, Roger's Place. That could be a bar. The Drunken Clam. Like, come on. What are y'all doing? And then, of course, SpongeBob with the Krusty Krab and the Simpsons and Duff Beer. I mean, it goes on and on, really. What's one fictional brand that you've seen in a movie or TV show that you would like to see come to life? Drop that down in the comments. I am Dmitry Garabedian, a high-ranking member of the Armenian Mafia. Roger's place pays us for protection. You recognize this woman? That's Constance Mathers. Where did you get this picture? The security camera. So I killed her. You can't what? do that! It is already done. Captain Francois <laughs> Dubonnet, French Interpol. I have devoted ten years of my life to toppling your criminal empire, Madame Marouche. Your reign of terror is over. And I am Raoul. You are too old and barren. I am leaving you for a real woman who can bear me a son. And I am Toro, Raoul's half-bull son from the future. My father's other testicle became stronger, and he met it with a bull to conceive me. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Oh, uh, we get black, Roger? Are you Lucius Mayweather? Who wants to know? Roger, what, what the wow. hell? Wow. Roger? No, <laughs> Lucius. You must be the white boy uh, looking for a wheel man. I'm in. For God's sakes, I'm assembling my own crew. <laughs> that cracker's got a crack in his head, if you ask me. You hustling me, boy? Barry, Toshi, you know my Uncle Roger. Ah, I'm not going to be a kid. Yeah, on my mom's side. And what Steve won't know is that I have my own plan. While everyone's focused on snot, I'll be heading to the bathroom to share a doobie with the busboy in exchange for an angry handy jay. I shall H bomb for the defense. <sighs> Don't you worry, kid. I'll win this for you. We'll get your foreskin cut off, all right. What? And oh. who shot Gianni Versace? <laughs> was it a Jew? I don't know. It was in Miami. Mail call. Per usual, I opened and read everything. You're welcome. Franny, you got some cleaning coupons, because that's what you do. And Klaus, you got nothing, because people think you're dead. You know, you don't have to say that every time. You could just not hand me anything. I can explain. Fire. A DeLorean? <gasps> Are you yeah. running coke? No. 
I get it. We'll talk later. I'm good for half a key. Tonight is going to be so much fun. I feel like the belle of the ball. Yeah, well, I'm the belle of the ball. You so look you like George Washington. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I says, hell, half the petty officers in the Seventh Fleet could have fathered that kid. Why am I the one that's got to pay to fix his cleft palate? But the whole thing was messy, so I jumped ship in Okinawa, caught a flight home, got back last night. Anywho, what's got you so glum? Oh, good lord, it's real. You know, Stan, it's too bad. I actually liked Francine. The rest of them can suck it, but Francine, I'm sorry to see die. Anytime I want, I could let out some bad wieners. Say, Stan, I'm the decider again. Oh, yeah? Oh, where, where do you keep these alleged death dogs? Well, they're not here. They're someplace safe. Someplace you'll never guess. The last place you would ever think to look. No, 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 don't look in the fridge. They're not in there. The hell in, why? Roger, let me go. I remember this episode. Now, 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 He's getting tortured. I'm waiting for my buddy so he can tell me if these look good. Should be just a few more minutes. You know, you don't, you don't need to stand there. I'll, I'll tell them you helped me. He's trying to run off on the plug. Thanks. Are we going to fool around? Only the best for my good friend. Oh, look at the friendly locals. Hola. Stan, put my brooches in the room safe. Okay, you were right. They were going to kill me. I can't believe you sacrificed your helicopter for me. I sacrificed it for my friend. Stan, Stan Smith. I'm, you know, have, I'm having trouble getting his voice right. You, you know what? I'm just going to make him sound like Sean Connery. Sweetheart, I'll have a mango teeny shaken, not stirred. 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 Is that how I say it? Stirred. Stirred. Why are you still here? Is food appropriate for a small dog? Oh, ma'am, I'm not qualified to answer that. See, I only oh. have one mouse on my name tag, which means I do stocking, lifting, oh, and the like. Oh, boy. You need to talk to someone with at least one dog. See, it goes one mouse, two Ooh. mouse, one bird, two bird, then one dog, then two dog. I hear there's a guy up in Portland with three dogs, but I think that's just an office rumor. Wouldn't it be something if it was true, though? Hey, Roger. What's going on? Not much. Just boring myself in this old broad. Relax, MC Raw G. Let it go. Are you kidding? Nobody cuts off Biggie Smalls. It's Big Papa. Hey, Jackass, <laughs> you want some of this? Oh, damn! Well, I guess Diddy didn't do it! <laughs> so, first, just a medical Yo. question. Where have you been going to the bathroom? <laughs> it's just that these are new socks, and I paid extra for Roger. monogramming is all. See? That's not a monogram, that's a penguin. My name is Dr. Penguin. What's happening? I was just about to do something really funny! Moses. I'll tell you what's happening. It's the end of the world, and we've been left behind! Oh, my God! The homeless guy from the bus station is hung. But I knew that. Why? I had to point out one quick thing. I've seen this character on American Dad before. I don't know his name. I'm sorry. But why does homie with the glasses and the mop look like bubbles from Trailer Park Boys? You can't tell me I ain't tripping. <laughs> Coffee. <laughs> or hot chocolate. Whoa, is that rich? Can't have too much of that. Another very bad race, Clancy. I'm Clancy. Sorry, Mr. McCormick. We'll do better next week. Unfortunately, there isn't going to be a next week. Mr. McCormick, no! Oh, uh, sorry, Clancy. Whoa! The only way I can recruit my losses on this horse is to shoot it in the face and collect the life insurance I took out when I married it. Sir! Hey! I didn't get to do that earlier. Stop telling Francine on me! Ow! Jeez, that really hurt! Oh, crap. <laughs> can I help you? I had an appointment with the horse whisperer. Oh, yes, he'll be right with you. Thank God I'm just his secretary. I'm an associate. <laughs> Roger Suave. Oh! Oh, boy. Oh, my God. Uh. Cut! Awful! <laughs> Who are you? The name's Ira Siegel. I directed the episode of Sybil, where Christine Baranski sat on her balls. 
Point is, I can direct this thing. Look how many pockets are on his jacket. I think we should let him do it. I know who Chex Limino is, and you're not him. It's because you're not seeing me in my outfit. Eh? Recognize me now? Mustache, courtesy of an L.L. Bean mannequin name of Frederick. Ah, uh, an alien and a mannequin. What were we thinking? We were young. The Smith sisters takes the precious from Call us. Them. Precious is ours. As... Oh, what a beautiful ring this is. He's not going to put it on his finger. Wait, this turns oh, okay. people invisible? Who needs to be invisible in the middle face. of nowhere? Where were you when I farted at <laughs> Danny's <laughs> wedding? <coughs> no, please! Roger, help! Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, please, no. No, no. No, wow! Oh, I'm falling! Somebody, please! My name is Clive Trotter, and I'm an American, and I am in trouble! Lucas, how'd you do? Oh, that's excellent. I probably got an A, though. You should study with me next time. Maybe order in a pizza and a two-liter? What do you like, Sprite? I sure do. Roger! What? No way! Wait, why is this wrong? <laughs> next to Miranda writes, I put Miranda has the right to a decent man who will help her raise her baby. Are these questions not about sex in the city? Lucas, why won't you tell me what kind of soda you like? If you had been in that parking lot, you would have kicked that mugger's ass. He humiliated me. I'm tired of being weak. Help me. I've been waiting to hear those words for a long time. I just pray they would come from my son and not an alien in a sports bra. It's a support tank. It's too small. It rode up my belly. So, you wanted to have lunch. Well, here I am. Thanks for ordering me a drink. Who we got? That's the cream. That explains why I went down oh, creaming. Oh, uh. This is exactly what we're talking about. Stan, will you put mine on? Friends. You've made me so happy. Look, they've got a wine train. We can ride. Wait, can we ride it? It's a small train that goes through the vineyards and carries passengers. Yes, we can ride the wine train. Choo -choo! Don't do that. Wine and drive. Yeah, see my rad new camera? I'm pursuing a newfound passion. Crime scene photography. Ooh, like the guys on CSI? That's yes, weird. Guys. Remember we were watching CSI together and I was like, I want to do that. And you were like, you totally should. Ring a bell? Not at all. Are you sure you weren't just high on angel dust talking to the ceiling fan? Oh, that's right. Hello, y'all. I'm Stan <laughs> Smith's brother, Appleby McFriday. Wow. Do you guys know Kreplach? Look hey, Rabbi, I have a joke for you. Two priests are hitting <laughs> on an altar boy. Uh, hello, guy who mistakenly believes he's my brother. Roger, what happened? Well, I guess sometimes a hole in a men's room stall is just a hole in a men's room stall. Ah. I've got a plan. <laughs> Does that plan include explaining why a footless blind man is giving an expert Bajowski to our baggage handler? Admire the skills. I want a roast. Roger, do you even know what a roast is? Of course I do. I was a member of the Friars Club in the 60s. I drove Phyllis Diller to two of her first three abortions. She must have such regret never getting her driver's license. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have my bowling league tonight. I'm a roly turkey tonight, Who do you think you are? I am. Shout out Pete Weber. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this? What? What did I ever do to any of you to make you say those incredibly hurtful things? The roast. Does it look like I'm not serious? Who's that positive <laughs> girl? With you? This is Allie, my life coach. She also works at Jumbo Juice. She gave me a fiber boost, then she gave me a life boost. All right, nice on the uh, juice plug. <laughs> she has weird energy, doesn't she? <gasps> Maybe it's Haley. Call autism. Haley? No, it's Roger. Roger, can I call you back? You don't have to. I'm right next to you. You didn't see me setting all this stuff up? Now we're in the same scene. <laughs> Thanks, Don. I'm done with this. Roger? What the hell are you doing in Thailand? Oh, my God. It worked. Thailand, huh? We in Thailand. Like three 12-year-old boys, no MSG. Usually when I see men in Crazy. cages, they're kissing each other, and I'm throwing pesos at them. Peso. <laughs> Kiss. Why? Kiss. Roger. Peso. Roger, what are you doing? Signing you up for an adult literacy class. Nocturnal petting Nocturnal zoo. Petting zoo. Lord. Get out of here! I warned you, Dugan. Dugan, <laughs> there's urine in this bottle. 
How to do it? Put him in there. Friends, a big bold step called the confidence. Barrel Roger. You're fired. You can't fire me from my own restaurant. Actually, it's all mine. The bank wouldn't lend you 50 cents. The restaurant, the truck, the napkin holders, they're all mine. Called you broke, huh? Show you I'm a good guy. I got you this. Ta da! <laughs> the perfect split. You like that? Get off my property. <laughs> what can I get you, Mac? Uh, I'm meeting friends at. Can I use you, crap? Get out of here. There's a bathroom in the park. The service here sucks. Have you even seen a waiter? What am I doing? This isn't helping me. If that's really from our kitchen, then you can eat the plate. All right, Kurt. Delicious. That's supposed to be and Kurt Cobain. I'll you, man, fish, what? and wife. Now for my payment. <clears throat> hawk, hawk. Whoa! Pleasure doing business with you. All you need is a manager, and you're on your way. I wouldn't Roger. even begin to find it. Sweeps McCullough, talent manager. I used to represent every sitcom neighbor and sidekick in the 80s. That was I fast. I discovered Mindy Cohn, Willie Ames, the slow kid from Life Goes On. Was mm -hmm. that a comedy? Was to me. Butterfly knife and a hustler. Thanks, Uncle Cappy. I'm not Uncle Cappy. Great just yet. gift. I still have to get drunk. Now I like to call <laughs> Mr. Sugar to the stand. Guess who's the luckiest guy in the courtroom? Bert, because he gets to watch my big round ass as I walk to the stand. <laughs> I mean, who yeah. are you? I'm Bob Danilou. <laughs> I make gluten-free desserts. Not gonna lie, we're struggling at the moment. Oh my god, he is so guilty. You're voting guilty, right? You can't know he's guilty yet. Everyone's guilty of something. You're guilty of having incredibly kissable lips. Oh, they're plump and sweet like ripe cherries. Riz. I'll vote guilty if you want me to. Ooh. Of course you will. But I've got a random question. Nice. Do you sell watch batteries? Just for that question, yeah. Watch batteries. Get out. They're totally safe, <laughs> and you look fantastic. Simple Jack. Ha! <laughs> Who <laughs> farted? This guy. Set off the fire alarm. That's crazy. Hi, Sarah. Pete Pendleman, concrete man out of Sheboygan. Let's walk and talk. Roger. Damn it! It didn't work. It was Roger. The name's Reaganomics Lamborghini, jacuzzi dealer. This is supposed Wanna to be Roger Troutman? A pipe made from a Rubik's Cube? Wait a minute. Ah! I could be wrong, but I think he's doing Roger from Zap and Roger. Y'all know, computer love. Like, like all those songs and I want to be your man. I think that's Roger dressing up as Roger. <laughs> I remember the good old days when Twitter was just another word for late night beaver down by the creek. I need some peanuts and cracker jacks. I don't care if I Wait, what are we doing? I want to talk about my dad. I don't even like baseball. Well, me neither. I thought you wanted to go. I'm Ace Chapman, star forward. For... Wait, does it have to be consensual sex? That's Jackie yes. Moon. <laughs> okay, well then, you definitely don't want Ace. <laughs> oh, oh, don't take those. You will be conscious but paralyzed for 12 hours. Bing Cooper, wow. sexually active high school senior. I've pulled more tail than a slow kid at a petting zoo. That's have a good day at school, and son. Jesus. I'm already having a good day because <laughs> you called me son. Now give me a kiss. <clears throat> kiss me on the lips, Dad. I want that kind of relationship with you. Roger. You thought about it. I saw it. All these people what? walking around without bags. Buy something. You're killing this mall. Facts. All your pretzels. That's good. Facts. Brought it from home. Oh, hey, save the mall. Do you like it? Don't tell anyone. You'll get in trouble too. Stop. Where's Roger's Roger? Roger's a toucher. I left in the middle of the song. It turned into all gibberish and I won't be a part of it. I have a confession to make, and it's that Grease is trash. Y'all really love that movie that much? Like, I've seen Grease a couple, like, what? Is, it's a musical, and it, ugh. Y'all can watch Grease. I'm watching The Outsiders, okay? Hey, Ginger Scoops. I was looking at nudie mags in that field, and I need you to check me for ticks. Nice. Anything? Not nice. We're tough to see. <laughs> you just concentrate Damn. on being the creative force God made you and leave the rest to me. To our new business. To our new... Ah! 
These are a lot stronger than when I was a kid. Yo, I can't lie. As a kid, I was actually afraid of party poppers. That's what I thought was going to happen to me. Like, I thought, like, the like, I thought I was going to be blown back when I popped this thing. Like, I, I don't know why. That's just where my kid brain went. Like, I literally thought I was going to lose my hand. Hey, Roger. Yeah? I'm rooting for you. I know, Steve. You always were. I knew it wasn't true. The classes, the girlfriend, the sobriety. It was all a lie. Nice birdhouse. That's why I wasn't surprised to read in the paper that he had OD'd not ten seconds later. <laughs> ten seconds? And he read Our it in the newspaper. He's, he's right the there. Scene. Give a warm welcome to what? Mr. Cuss Mustard. <laughs> Thank you kindly. I love drinking and race cars and big old fat women. And Jesus is awesome. He rose on Thanksgiving. Erica. Ah, ah, you, I saw you. National anthem right there. Hey, what happened to being a country singer? Ah, living the honky tonk life was too hard. I'm doing calypso dancing now. Oh, damn it, Asian. Yeah, I'm Classic. <laughs> yeah, hey, could I get that sweatshirt back from you? It looks pretty nasty out there. Maybe I could just wear it and give it back to you next time. Yeah, it's just, it's kind of my favorite. I'll get it here. College. You're not my girlfriend. Give it back. You. I just want to wear it for a while. Stop taking our hoodies. <sighs> it smells like us. Uh, get, I smash. Now go. No. 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 <laughs> no. That's the dude no. I was telling you about while we were playing army no. guys. Oh, the weird shorts no. guy. He no. comes in every weekend, no. tries on all the shorts, no. and never buys anything. Mm. Where's a mirror? <laughs> what? Shorts. Is he supposed to be a metrosexual? Like, what's going on? Speedwalk is probably crazy. Where did you get it? Oh, I got a great deal. This limo company went out of business. Ah, oh, you know damn well I stole it. You doing the Nigerian medical <laughs> student? Yep. First one in my village to pretend to become a doctor. Oh, and he's scamming damn for handsome, sure. Handsome. You're the most stunning woman I've ever seen. Ah, uh, I'm Scarlet. <clears throat> it's almost ready. Just need to do the final test. This eggnog? Eggnog's eye. Whoa! Never mind! Oh, this is crazy! Yes, my son? Roger, what are you doing? <laughs> well, you were talking so much about this, it sounded me like me with fun. my shirt off. It's not, but it was a good excuse to work on my abs. <laughs> and my savior bulge. Jeff, you don't Jesus. Do you cool, me neither. Quilo! <laughs> Quilo, cape or no cape? Which one of you doesn't want the cape? Oh no, we both do. We're, we're just arguing about who loves them more. You won't Gotta be undersold. Try this same camcorder at Monty's for $20 less. You have your receipt? No, I don't have a receipt. I stole the floor model. You can't be the masked hero. It's I refuse to answer any questions without what? my lawyer present. The floor the model. Bird distracted me on my backswing. It was going. Kick, kick, kick. That's not my name, and it was saying it right at me. Yes, yes Mr. Mr. Vanderhill. Vanderhill. Oh, oh my God, you stupid bitch! Why did you drop me? I can't breathe. Why can't you do that move, you stupid bitch? I'll kill you. How long has this been here? Construction of the museum began in 1998. I should know because, oh. like Ross on Friends, I'm a docent. But unlike Ross, I don't look like a Monchichi. Prince Somebody sucks. Up snot! Uh, aren't you Snot? I'm Barry! Stan, I might have got the wrong one. Dmitry Crutch licked me off. New exchange student from Russia. What name was that? That was cool. That was. A <laughs> uh, word of caution I would refrain from sharing popcorn with a gentleman to your left as I saw him cut a hole in the bottom of his bucket. Aha, he's kidding. Popcorn? What's up, ladies? Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry about the boy. He drives so smooth you can boil an egg on the engine. 
When we bring the car back, I'll peel the egg for you. We're not having a real conversation, are we? You're, you're just waiting for me to finish so you can say your next thing. Freddy, you're no spring chicken, are you? Oh, come on, man. You don't have to do this. Do people really care what I just ate? Oh, I want a bagel. I haven't had a bagel in forever. Facebook is all about reconnecting. Facebook sucks. Yeah, Facebook is absolute trash. Once our grandparents got on there, it was a wrap. But let me know down in the comments, what do you think is the GOAT social media? What is your go-to social media? Drop that down below. Elian, is that you, baby? Come on in, you're safe here. I will not send you back to Cuba. Ricky Spanish. <laughs> Ricky Spanish. The Ricky GOAT for Spanish. real. <laughs> Ricky Spanish. <laughs> DC car collection. Toyota Camry. Only 32 made in the world. Is that Jose! true? Sam! Fact, fact check that for me, chat. Sam, mon ami! Hi, I'm Christopher, and this is my adopted daughter, Opal Louise. We are having quite okay. a day. My Prius's nickel battery is acting up, my iPhone's as dead as Farrah Fawcett, and my life partner, Michael, is at a Grey Goose event in Reykjavik. Can I use your phone? Get in my house now. This place is just <laughs> what Langley Falls needs. A chic lounge <laughs> environment for young professionals. If they need it so much, how come there's nobody here? I'm gonna eat you one day. Oh, goldfish! No! Steve, Whoa! I freaked out. Hey, babe, let's go try that weird skiing. That's like what is this. happening? Remind me to never take this hat off. I got everything held together up there with a chip clip. Yeah, I don't remember this episode at all. So if you could just let me know down in the comments what in the it puts the lotion on its skin is going on, that would be greatly appreciated. Hello there. I'm George Hamilton 20 years ago. Oh my god, I loved you! Would you like to play a set of tennis? Actually, she's with me. Oh, I see. Hey, how about we play a new game? What's in our fanny packs? I have a scorecard from my last round of golf. I shot a 206 and a half full Subway sandwich card. What's in yours? I don't think that's any of your. <laughs> what is it? A strange thing to carry around. I like to leave mine in the toilet. And now I'm going to turn on the water, and you're going to feel a little pressure. Yeah. Oh, she's in the anus. Real good. The BH. Uh, oh, you can turn it up a bit. All the way. This ain't my first butt blast. Oh, you know what, Ladon? Turn it down just a little. Oh, matter, it's doo-doo do water. Sean Ian, I'm just going to... Oh, gross. Right How does that feel? Good? Good. Okay, now I'm just going to put my thumb in your mouth. How does that feel? Good. Lawsuit. Shut it down, pack it up. What? Of course, it's not the original wow. Niagara Falls, which burned down in <laughs> 1816. This is getting ridiculous. You want me to walk you home again? It didn't help last time. This, our, this is crazy. He's just trying to help the kid out. Are they going to show it? I'm going to rape him this time. Evening, sir. I'm here for Mr. and Mrs. For display purposes only. This is not a real cell phone. God, naked men look so stupid in shoes. Oh, that's the P-Star look. Dumb. Women Gotta have the Tims. Only shoes. Yeah, because they make kick-ass female stripper shoes. The socks Meanwhile, on. no one's making male stripper shoes. My eyes! That's the froggy style Ow! outfit. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Ow! Ow! Look at this. What a cool biplane. Giuseppe, did you draw this? See, si, see, si, trace. I, I trace. What? I traced it. I miss MXC. Mardi Gras, bitches. I'm having a party at my bar. I got beads aplenty, so I want to see all your tatas. Except you, Haley. You have the worst boobs. They're, they're like 90% nips. Like two dark castles with tiny little moats. We roasted you! Burn!
You were smashed, man. Yes! You kept high-fiving that black guy. He was not into it. My man! Up top! My dog! Twill Anjanbone. It's just you? Where is everybody? Hey, could you pull over for a sec? Oh, he's got to make it look like he was running. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, what a gorgeous trophy and flowers. That's so Wait, common too. Why do why do people even join home. races? It's five wow. in the morning. What are you doing? Why, I'm getting ready to go to the dig site. Come on, Roger. What are you really doing? Well, why don't I show you? I, I knew we had to start south, where an ancient tribe would have a fresh water source. How okay. do you know all this? Well, hell, Francine. I'm an archaeologist. Why do you keep leaning in when I say stuff? <laughs> Take off your shirt and throw it to me. Roger. It's disgusting. You got the part. No, 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 no. Eyes on me. One and two and kick and tush and kick and push and finger, 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 finger. <sighs> well, that's over. Oh, damn it! You, you following my daughter? Screw you, buddy! Get out of here, you pervert! Your weird daughter made me miss the zeros! She, she made me miss the thing! You freako! I don't know what you're talking about! Get back in your house! Get back in your damn house! Relax, people will show. <laughs> I mean, we're the only game in town. <clears throat> I mean, it's not like there's anyone else in Langley Falls working their asses off to keep alive the orchestral folk traditions of Tsarist Russia! Nerd Squad, I'm Trevor. Your wife called, your TV's out. Oh, Roger, He's awesome. back in the froggy-style outfit. Trevor. Wait, do you really know what you're doing, or is this just a disguise? <laughs> Washington Sir, I have edition. I a family, too, that I would like to spend Thanksgiving with, so if you could just show me your TV. Sorry, Haley. I've made other dessert plans. Haley, you didn't think I was going to let Big Wang slip through my fingers, did you? Come on, I still got two big installs <laughs> tonight, but only Bars. one more job to do, if you get my drift. <laughs> oh my god, this is just like Hideki. If we listen to it, we'll get rich. Do you really think it could work? I think someone does. They need to be together. What's that? Need an investor? Against the window is wild. Oh my god, we're really doing this. Next. Wow. Roger? The name is Kevin Ramage. Roger? I'm only doing this one more time. Kevin. The name is Kevin Ramage. Word on the street is you're horning in on my business. Yeah, well, word on the street is your product sucks. Yeah, well, word on the street is I don't have a comeback for that, but what I do have are these brawny sidemen. Show them the rough stuff, boys. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't get out of my territory, this is gonna be you. Can I go out with you and Kevin tonight? Brandon, leave my friends alone. <sighs> my family sucks. Now, if this light would just turn red, <laughs> we'd Slim have shady. one hell of a picture. Hey, come on, what are you waiting for? Roger! Out your ass. That's what you're trying to do. How long was oh. I out? This long or this long? The first one. <laughs> Yo. Do all this, I'm about to become a jock. <laughs> what is it, Adderall? Protein powder? You're never gonna use any of that stuff. That was amazing, Roger. See what happens when you listen to me? He picked every horse. Hey, where did nice. everybody go? They ditched you, friend. Sorry, y'all. But not me. I just rudely walked away as you were talking. You did? When did you? Oh, I get it. <laughs> you really think this is gonna work? Sure. With your face on my face, I'll be dragging Jenna into the creek behind school and this harvesting so her organs weird. in no time. No, that's not the plan. Okay, you should probably write down what you want me to do. She's pregnant. Her parents won't help, and she's all alone. I, I don't know what to do. Well, I think it's pretty obvious what you need to do. And what's you that? You need to kick this bitch to the curb. Good advice. And I hope you don't drop that baby as much as you drop the football. <laughs> now get out of here. Your oh. bleeding, Shut up and hit the showers, Figus. That is just one of the creepiest things that anyone could ever do. I know uh, crimes are bad. I've seen documentary. Don't get me wrong. It's all bad. None of it is okay. But like when you're like taking the skin off and like tucking your stuff between your legs and putting someone else's skin on you and wearing skin suits and skin. Oh, yeah. That is just like 
Your brain needs to be donated to science because I don't understand. What the? F like I read a story about a guy that did that, but with four skins. Oh, like he would put theirs on his, and it's just like, sir. Like, yeah, you unalive people, but all that made me forget about all. Like, what are you doing? Craziest prop bet I ever took. That's right, Sammy. Now give me my pack of lifesavers. You're not gonna Ugh. be this lucky forever, Roger. Hard lifesavers? It's the gummies, yo. Like, what are you doing? Recognize this little guy? Ugh. It's the goat you bought for that family in Africa. Wait, how, how did you get him? Give me that certificate, Haley. Roger, Ooh. what the hell are you doing? Hand over that star certificate <laughs> or the goat gets it. Are you crazy? I don't know. I just went on a 53-hour trim fueled trip to Senegal to kidnap a goat. You tell me. Now that you're a bartender, people are going to share a lot of things with you. And the better listener you are, the better tips you'll get. Except for Carlos. He's going to offer you a tip. You don't want that tip. That tip is connected to his body. If you don't play, uh, why are gotcha. you wearing a Martin Guitar t-shirt? That's because I'm a hipster dumbass. We pretend to be stuff. The loser never comes back here, even in a mask. See you in a week, Mr. Hip. See you in a week. Um. Jamal. Your name's Jamal? But you're white. So? Is this really the he first time you've so? had this conversation? Come on, Jamal. You know, I've never used these ribbed ones, but I assume they work like gangbusters. Jojo Quinoa. And just like the superfood, I'm for sale at Trader Joe's. Behind Trader Joe's. For free. You're ready. Now make me four more. But the tournament is in 20 minutes. Don't worry about time. Let me worry about time. Shit, shit, damn it. We're so f***ing late. Oh, I've entertained satisfied visitors from all over the world. Omar, Benjamin, Chinese peasant. Mantu here was so happy he tipped me a narwhal tusk. Got 75 cents for it on eBay. Took a bath on the shipping. <coughs> oh dear, I hope I haven't woken you. Of course not. We're always here to serve. Mm, I'm feeling a bit peckish. Could you have the kitchen send up some bacon-wrapped scallops? I'll get my chef right on it. And some lavender-scented hand towels? I'll speak to the maids. Also, it's dark, so I can't be sure, but the lawn looks a bit scruffy by the bristly dewberry bush. I'll check immediately. What time what of night is it? Who is this guy? Yeah, go to bed. I ask you once again. Where did you bury it, Michael? I see. Think you're gonna hide behind the coma? Yep. <laughs> you always did go for the big moves, didn't you? But I got some moves of my own. Why did I hide this coffee? They probably wouldn't let me carry this in here. Lavar Crush, life coach. What do you do when life gets you down? Crush it! <laughs> like I said, I'm working on full out. Sandman. Arbuckle T. Boone, life coach. Who'd you used to be with? <laughs> Lavar Crush? Lavar Crush is shit. I went to life coach school with him. He's a hack. Well, what do we have here? An athlete or a pervert? Ignore me. I'm just a divorced dad with weekend visitation. Gregory! What are you doing over there by the jets? I don't care if it fits. You pull it out of that jet. Gregory! So, what oh, is this Gregory! In Do I put sock on the <laughs> yeah. door handle if I am being raped? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, can you give us a second? Michael, we're happy you're here, but you're gonna have to lose the nasty accent. It's nasty, nasty. Sure, no problem. How's this? I told you he'd be a genius. Roger, I'm glad you're not straddling me anymore, but you're ruining your Build-A-Bear. Hey, if he doesn't like it, he can say build something. Build-A-Bear. That's why I gave him three mouths. Never went. Well, that's not why. <gasps> it's the... Oh, the Roger. The Asphalt King. He runs Asphalt in this town. Don't you think I know that? Y'all know me. Y'all know what I do. I sling the hot stuff. The flat makings. The stone carpet. Free Asphalt! <laughs> Marconi Brothers. I knew it'd be you. You have to cancel this project you promised. But I don't control anything around here. I'm just dumb old Frankie. My twin brother Freddy's the boss, and what he says goes. Haley, what's your wildest fantasy? I've been kidnapped by three African guys, and while the whole village watches, their most powerful warrior demands that I disrobe. Whoa, okay, fascinating. We'll return to, but I meant your wildest food fantasy. Hey, Stan, you need okay. to get home. Okay, I was interested. I went to a scaffolding company, and there's, uh, 
There's a lot of dead migrant workers here. Their families are asking a lot of questions. I could really use somebody on damage control, so get here. All right, fine, we can go. But since you're in such a hurry... What happened? I threw up, but the cookie blocked it. I'm getting hit from every angle here. Oh, that was a cookie See, cake. I drafted a bill proposing drinking water not be poisonous. Now let's drop it off and hit the road. Well, if it isn't Bert Jarvis. Looking good, old friend. Say, we gotta get you and Carla up to the lake house. You wouldn't believe the size of the trout this season. And are they a biting? I hear you've been working on a clean water bill. Now this is a nice piece of legislation. A noble undertaking indeed. It's a shame no one got to see it. My best to Carla. What a Did dick. you hear that? I'm gonna get to go fishing. People, this company has brought nothing but pain and suffering to our community, and I'm shutting it down. You just turned off the receptionist's computer. Well, not even that, <laughs> just the monitor. <laughs> right, sorry for trying to make it look cool for you, Steve. To actually close this place Ugh. down, I have to send like 13 emails all saying the same thing, all to Cliff in operations. Yeah, I'm I'm bored just saying it. Good Tedious. for you, Roger. The name is Jeremy Niederhoff, college freshman. Niederhoff! It's really great when you find something <laughs> you're yeah. passionate about. I'm happy for you, but I'm also a little jealous. You know, I never went to college. And look at you now, driving someone else to college. Wow. My name is Mr. Deliver. You're dead, Teach. <laughs> How can I teach these kids? Four, three, two, one. Ugh. Break it. How could she compliment your order and not mine? <laughs> Did she? Please, she practically dry-humped your turd of an order. Mine was inspired. She should have said great order to me. Maybe she sensed that you were going to make me pay. Of course you're paying for ah. this. What do you think was paying for this? That I'd pay for this? Never. For the way I've been treated? I'm not. I don't want to do this. Since when did that ever affect what we do? So, you know the plan? Yeah. We reverse our orders from the last time to see if she compliments your order. Blonde she Haley. We'll know it's personal. And if it's personal... It works. to guess which direction the shit's going, Haley? A, down. B, up. C, none of the above. Take the test, Haley. A. Which one was A? Down. That's right. Lady, you are about to deeply regret not telling me you liked my order. Sounds trivial when I say it out he loud, but petty. I know in my heart it's not. I'll have the recovery. Roger is petty. And the filet of soul. That is a great order. A great order. And you? Tough order to follow. Bed shitting potential is high. I'll have the same. <laughs> So, is he dangerous? No, just a few the misunderstandings. Orca with the mask the with the muzzle is Canadian crazy. Heart, then you're going to have to fire me, too. Crisscross applesauce. Roger is Wesley hey, Snipes. Hey, everyone, I brought a new guy. His name is Ooh, well. Ellie Jesusworth. <laughs> you're a reporter now. His black characters Roger? are the best. No, call me Roger. Call me <laughs> Deep Throat. What are you doing? Every reporter needs a Deep Throat, Sonny. And I know wow. things. I've seen things around this school. I have a story for you that'll turn Look you into a Look at his two different hair legend. colors. I don't need a deep throat, <laughs> Roger. I bought the jacket, Steve. I'm doing this. <laughs> if it ends this, I'm in your hands. Perfect. These are the same hands that choked Lisa Bonet when she beat me out for the role of Denise Huxtable on A Different World. That was a lie. The role was created <laughs> for her. But I did choke her. And this is just one of many benefits. The next is Eat Day. Eat Day is just what it sounds like. Then there's Bone Day. You just wake up and start plowing babes all day. Roger, you... you sell sperm too? Stan! Sell. Hey, you look like oh, me! Oh, he bought crazy. it! I gotta get a pick. Roger! Twinsies! <laughs> Ryan has turned me into a horrible, grotesque monster. <gasps> well, you're not having any trouble with brutal honesty right now. I'm just not built to be a liar. No, you're built to be a jerk! <laughs> Double my order! Imagine a person who didn't want to hear the tour in played. I can't even start. I mean, what? Okay, okay, I need to put that kind of person out of my mind. Because that kind of person makes me furious! Oh, no.
Testing, testing. Can't he just play it, Roger? It's my shift to watch Stan again. Look, Stan's as good as dead. His heart stopped four times last night, right? And he's leaving on a suicide mission tomorrow. So please, let's focus on what still matters. This is the first recording, at least on Earth, of the Turin. What, what, what's this about a suicide mission? Hey! You can't touch that! <sighs> and you are? Chuck Deptula, Union Gaffer. But everybody calls me. I Chase. like that shirt. You seem to be a lot more helpful Fire now movie. than you were the other day. Now the International Brotherhood of Film Grips, Session Drummers, and Pool Table Repairmen has my back. Scab. That's lunch. <laughs> McManahan Industries. There's no Tasha here, pal. Welcome back, everyone. Namaste. 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 He's taking over the whole place. Oh, good. At least I can take this class taught by Dalton Galloway. Oh, Haley, does Dalton Galloway sound like a real person to you? It's him, too. Grow up, it's me. <laughs> now that I'm really touch, I knew touch it. Me. Touch me. I'm not touching anybody. That's what I said. Now leave me alone. Just Roger. Spurned the party scene of New York City, but he died anyway of party-related diseases in the arms of the wife he had so often humiliated. Oz. I'm surprised. I thought Reynolds Jasper Terrian was going to be you. I got to tell you, I did, too. Tato Monticello, art heist guy. Of course. Okay. Steal the painting. Exactly. And I'm going to help you because, are you ready? This is a good one. I, I cannot believe this hasn't been in a movie already. Stealing art is the greatest art of all. Oh, screw you, Stan. I'm calling my Coke dealer. Whoa, he can afford the painting? Oh, yeah, maybe he could buy the painting. <laughs> Oh yeah, the painting. I told you, a whole show starring Roger. Kit Kittering. Make it happen, man. Seth MacFarlane, TBS, whoever I have to get this to, please give Roger his own series. It will be worth it. I'm telling you, you're sitting on a gold mine. Give this character its own spinoff. It is deserved. The possibilities are endless. The storylines, the character development, the new characters, like, li like literally, the possibilities are endless. Why are you not doing this? He's in danger. Are you seriously trying to talk to me right now? Do you not understand how Grinder works? We did what we came to do, but now I'm with my family. This Crazy. is my real life. You're way out of bounds. Um, I think, I think you're confusing me with someone else. Roger? The name's Twanderlust Lumpkin, and this is my house of curiosities. You do not want this book. Oh, my meatball hoagie's ready next door. While I'm gone, don't think about that book, Steve. Don't think about it. Yuck. But let's go over the facts. My name is Frank True Blue. I get my hair cut at barber shops. Look at me, Stacy. Do I not have all the signifiers of an off-duty cop? No one's saying you're not like a cop, Frank. Everybody thinks that. You kids. You think look like an off-duty cop, cop, sir. Right? <laughs> my dad's a cop. Guess what? <laughs> I'm into classic cars now. Screw the mail. Oh yeah. That's right. I'm going to be one of those regal road dogs showing off his wheels in the Bob's Big Boy parking lot. A real PTHer. PTH stands for pop the hood. We have our own lingo, us car heads. Car heads meaning car likers. That's... The year was 1978, Ugh. and I had a weekly spot at the comedy store. I was an angry comic, very political, driven beyond all reason to shock people. Okay. And in the audience one night was a young Jay Leno. Oh my God, Leno <laughs> stole your jokes? <laughs> Yeah, no, now that I think of it, he was actually just giving me helpful feedback. Good question. Hmm. Who is the current vice president? Oh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> tickets? Need tickets? I got them. Have tickets? I want them. Need a wheelchair? Why does I he look it. like Have moist critical? I want it. Need a high protein <laughs> snack on the go? Try walnuts. You were a part of those riots in Aberdeen? A part? How dare he you? He started I them. I picked the targets. I set the fires. I was an integral There part. you go. Here we are at the museum. Wonderful. And you owe me nothing for the ride, since you won't let me turn the meter on. On this day, it was sunny, so we're going to find some Look sun. Look at the eyes, yo. Following the weather, wherever it takes us. 
whether we like it or not. <laughs> I know. Tell him if I have AIDS or not. You, uh, still don't have AIDS. Hear that, Francine? Doc's given me a prescription for raw dogging. Yeah! My name, and I hope it's trending right now, is Jaeger Chillax. It is not trending. I'm not some prostitute who's gonna take you to the back room. What? I'm a freewheeling party boy who will slob your knob right here. Just untuck your Tommy Bahama and give me a little privacy curtain. Roger! Oh, that's my dog. The Ghostbusters the theme song. Johnny, in your neighborhood, I need you to... Who you gonna call? Jerk that Ghostbusters. guy off. Ghostbusters! Whoa! Guess who got himself hey arrested? Oh, donkey balls. I knew I couldn't be without you, so I started shooting at passing cars on the highway. They didn't get me for that, though. It was a pair of batting gloves I stole from Modell. <laughs> Being by myself for 30 days straight, I learned that I'm never oh, alone with all the well. voices in my head. Isn't that right, Lucas? You're right, Roger. It took you a while to forget about Klaus, but then you realized you have me to fill the void. Lucas is my workout buddy. He came to me in a night terror. Do not go in there. That's Ace Ventura. Just storage wars <laughs> the crap out of this auction. I went all in. Had a really good feeling about this. Storage bad boy. wars. Now to find out what my 800 bucks. I forgot got to about me. storage wars. Oh shit! It's all doll heads. I don't need these. I already have a bunch of doll heads. I keep them down in a storage unit. I quit paying for. Figured some sucker would buy it at auction. Damn it! This is my unit. Yeah. The real action happens in the back. <laughs> Hi. Nope. Get out. Yep. This is the place. That gentleman was nice enough to remind me I'm not allowed back there until I settle my debts. The Madison Square Garden of Bumper Pool. You're gonna get to play him. Here he comes. Never played Bumper Pool. I'm I a regular <laughs> pool though. <sighs> You're a South Dakota Slim. Yep, or as my mom calls me, Justin. Where do you think you're going? I'm going to find Dad. I'm back, baby. Oh, I knew you'd come home. He's got a whole and family. I the big deal. Hey, Multiple lady, families. You ever seen a woodpecker? Want to see mine? <laughs> God damn it! Crazy. This is why we okay. Rehearsed with a bird. Oh, here's a joke. That was why good. Why can't you starve in the desert? Because of the sand that is there. You know, it takes guts to tell a joke to a group of strangers. Especially since I'm not naturally funny. Oh, you're naturally funny? Looking! <laughs> <laughs> you gotta watch who you're talking you can't to. starve in the desert because of the sand which is there. Oh, sandwiches? You said send that is. I blew the punchline. That was what it was. Still, the setup was rock solid. I'm getting better. Santa Claus is real. And he's Jewish. Uh, I remember. <gasps> I remember this one. Of course. Oh, great. Look what you dragged in with you, Haley. They all kind of look know, alike. The nerdy my characters doctor recommended do. recommended I volunteer to get over my crippling social anxiety. How's my eye contact? Sit down. So what are you, what are you like, a rain man, shy guy, some kind of lovely bones? Or are you just giving Jim here a run for his money for troglodyte of the year? <laughs> you better go tell the other bog people there's a new king of the creeps in town, eh? Jimbo! <laughs> and a blue jay! And a Russian spy satellite falling through the atmosphere! It struck a blimp! The blimp is out of control! The blimp is careening towards the power and plant! And you just witnessed... Birds, Steve. <laughs> a pigeon! <laughs> there it is. The Order of the Hand and Nest is happy to welcome a new member. St. John, St. John, retired maritime lawyer and avid egg collector. Ooh. Oh! The I don't know if that was yoke. Is collected. I know you all probably need a second to reload, but I can go again. Not a brag, just a fact. The teacher here is supposed to be the most intense and demanding instructor in all of clowning and shit. It's Roger, isn't it? It's gonna be Roger. All right, Jagoffs. The name's H.J. <laughs> Rimmons. Look to your left. He already Look to knew. your right. By the end of the semester, 60% of you will be dead by your own hand. That's right. I've returned. 
as an it-style evil clown named Glad Hands, thirsting for revenge. That's Glad Hands with a Z. I'll haunt your every dream until finally I lure you into the depths of the sewer and to your doom. Uh-huh. And how are you going to do that then? Um, get in the sewer. <sighs> I'll level with you, Steve. I didn't think this through. I caught wind on LinkedIn of how well you were doing out here, and I, I guess I just kind of lost it. Next thing you know, I'm filing my teeth down to points and climbing into a sewer drain. I'll be straight with you, Steve. I need your help. Both financially and just, you know, to get out of the sewer. Of course. How long ago Of course, you Roger. Oh, quite a while ago. <laughs> and you <laughs> shall inherit the curse of glad hands. <laughs> Francine, I have an unregistered gun in the glove box. Say Is that Jesse officer, Pinkman? You want me to shoot our way out of this? Guess I'm tight. Actually, that was a cough. Oh. Epic fail! Oh! Yeah, I got a burnt one. I don't understand. I do oh. eat that spider. Why don't we Ugh. get away from that? It actually tasted okay. Spiders! Like a hairy croissant full no. of blood. Fine, if it'll shut you up, we can go there after the game. Thanks, Dan. Some roadhead to celebrate? I've never met He went for it. Hell. That's but crazy. At w. Willard Warts, I ran Adelaide <laughs> oh Stevenson's presidential bids in 52 and 56. Landslide losses. Laughed out of the beltway. Swore off politics forever. You have to run for mayor. Look at this new sign. Oops, old sign. <laughs> but timeless message. Roger, get out of there! He ain't getting out of there. Boom! <laughs> Rock on! Three wheels. So safe. Makes way more sense. Renegade. Got a point. You picked the wrong day to come in here. We got us a renegade. Renegade. Mm, the fries are so good. I remember this Who's one. The renegade. This guy? Please, sir, help us! Fries, 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 fries. So, unless anyone has any other business... Smut! Our children are being corrupted by smut! It's everywhere! Just look at this pervert! Calls herself a librarian. I call her a smut peddler! The name's Plum Smut Mistlestock, peddler's and I crazy. And I say we burn all the books in the library. <laughs> Finally, someone said it! They're gonna read new books. My books! I rewrote oh, all the classics, Lord. but took out all the dongs. Who needs the great Gatsby when they have the greatest Gatsby? Totally smut-free, clean as a freshly washed dong. I don't Other know about that. I've sanitized Uncle Tom's luxurious ski chalet, little but legal women, and Moby Dickless. Don't you worry, Max Jets will take care of everything. But first, I missed a lot of elections, so I gotta vote real quick. Beep, beep. Beep, wow, beep, beep. sir! I'm so glad you're back, Max. Me too. Up oh, special election. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Roger is the ultimate beep, beep, beep. toucher. Cream covered That sucks. Cream covered boy. Wait a minute. This has to be a trap. But then again, it's better to know. He gonna go. Roger, oh, I thought he was gonna lick it off. Van in the driveway. Oh, that's Jackie, Francine's gym friend. Oh, there's another muscle lady in the house. Yes, there is, and she's a man. <laughs> well, so what? In pursuit of the perfect bikini front, I trained my penis to permanently recede into my body. How far? Out the back. It looks like oh. he has a tail. Show him, Jackie. I do to be shocked or impressed. Out on the town, and For everyone's both. checking out my new outfit. Excuse me. It's on. So, baby, what's your name? Black Nissan. You think I'm some car valet because of my white shirt, my bow tie, my sweet vest, my foreign accent? Uh. Oh, balls. Hold on, maybe <laughs> yeah. we just go with it. Could be a great opportunity to pick up a few bucks. And a lucky there break, you go. too. I don't have a dime on me. Nothing? You told me you were paying for the evening. That's right. <laughs> I see what happened here. I was lying to you, Klaus. I don't respect you. <laughs> Born without lungs. <laughs> Eric Reynolds, tall fifth grader. Quentin Poundtridge, Puerto Rican hand model. Okay. Mm. We got next. Not 
Nacho Bartiromo, serial killer. Yeah! <laughs> Probably because you're goofing uh, off all okay. the time doing your personas. Goofing off? I'll have you know, I got up at 4.30 this morning to get into character as Russian banana inspector a la Dewis Goof Off. Does that sound like goofing off to you? Fire what I names. Do matters, what I do matters, too. All right, it really matters whether or not you run around all day blowing guys. That is only a very large part of what I do. Battle of the Rogers. Chex Limino. There's so many, I told y'all. The GOAT. Max Jets, Ricky Tartoni, Go Roger, Dr. Penguin, Jojo Quinoa, Michael Corbin, and Jojo Man. Quinoa, and it's some handsome, Urbuckle Team Moon, Laszlo Morphin, Stam Fakowski, Dimitri Garabedia, Let's Get Ford This Show, Sidney Hoffman, Reganomics Lamborghini, Martin Sugar, Bert Jarvis, Cus Mustard, Frank Slee, Kevin Rammer. Oh, Stan. Hey, bros, what's going on? This is Cotton Man. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Cause subscribing makes you feel good. Subscribe, motherfucker.